Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back, Abit here from Visual Cube. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to create a light emitting materials and also how to implement that materials in your game engines. Make sure you're subscribed to this channel and don't forget to click that notification bell. So over here guys you can see that we have this lantern game asset and as you can see we have we have that uh, glowing material for that part over here. So if you want to create it, you can go here in materials and you can create a new material. And over here in surface, change from principal BSDF to emission and make that emission shader color white and put the strand on four. And don't forget to check this bloom over here to make this glow around. Okay. So if I go here, for example, and turn off these two lights, we can see that this lantern is making, making a light around. So you can do that by adding the point light inside of this part over here. So you can see here, I added the point light inside. And if I turn off that uh, lantern light, we can see we don't have that light around. But the question is, how can we create this in our game engine? So I'm gonna go and open up a Unity game engine and start creating this from scratch. But before we start doing things in Unity, I'm going to delete everything except this lantern here and this light inside. And I'm gonna go and export it in FBX file and you can export it whatever you want. Right now, I'm gonna go and jump in Unity. So right now, guys, we are in Unity. I create a new scene, new clean scene, and as you can see, we have this uh, directional light and camera. So I'm gonna delete this uh, directional light, and I'm gonna add our lantern asset. So I'm gonna click right click here, import new asset, and sci-fi lantern. And over here, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just simply drag that lantern over here. So I'm gonna put this uh, 0, 0, 0, 0, x, okay. And as you can see, we don't have materials on this. So we're gonna add materials. So I'm gonna speed up this process here to add my materials. So everything is gonna be in the description below. So don't worry, Just I'm just gonna speed up this process because it's boring. I created a material for every part on this lantern except this uh, glass part over here. So I call it the glass because I want to show you how to create this uh, glass material. So click right click here, create and create a new material. And I'm going to call it uh, glass lantern. In this inspector bar here, we're going to select emission. And in emission, I'm going to select this HDR. And the HDR, I'm gonna put white all the way up like this. And I forgot to drop this material over here. So drop it over here like this. And right now we can see that we have this emission material. And as I said, we can go here and uh, just slide this intensity so I can put it up like this, okay. To see what is happening on the ground, we need to add a plane. So I'm gonna go here in Game Object and 3D Object and select Plane. And position, we can move it on 0, 0, 0. And also we're gonna scale this up. All right. And as you can see, we have this uh, weird light on this plane. So that is because our light range is big so we need to scale this uh, range down all the way down like this and what i'm gonna do here we are gonna create this uh, glowing effect and to create this glowing effect in unity 
we need to select this option over here, which said draw hello. And I'm gonna select that part. And to be visible, we need to put this uh, range up like this. Okay, and intensity put down. Put intensity down like this. Okay, and now we have that, that effect. And also go here, shadow type and select no shadows. Move this up a little bit like this. And right now we have that glowing effect. And if you want, you can change the range a little bit. We can scale it up like this. And turn this intensity down, all the way down to 2.3. Okay, so as you can see, we don't have that light on the ground. So uh, as over here in Blender. So right now we don't have that uh, light on the ground. So we can do that by duplicating this uh, lantern light. So right click, duplicate. And over here, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna change some values. So first thing first, go and unselect this uh, draw halo, change the range like this. And also we're gonna add shadows. So add a soft shadows. And right now we have this uh, weird, weird shadow around it. To change that, we're gonna go here in the near plane and we're gonna move this near plane around for tree. Something like that. Okay, and also you can change the range as I said, and you can change intensity and do whatever you want. Okay guys, basically we're finished with this uh, asset here. As you can see, we are created a whole scene and one more thing, what I'm going to show you here is how to create this part over here to be transparent. So if you want to create a glass texture, actually. So go here and create a new material. And I'm going to call it a glass too. All right. And I'm going to put this material over here. And what I'm going to do over here in inspector tab, we can change here rendering mode into transparent. And over here in albedo, Select that and alpha channel put down like this. And as you can see, we have that transparent material in Unity. So guys, that is it for this video. I hope you learned something in this tutorial. If this tutorial was useful, share this video with your friends, like this video, and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Cabot here from Visual Cube and see you in the next tutorial.